I'm working for BSF Switzerland in a global position as technology manager for plastic additives. I was in 91 and 92 in the ITHO in Poland and in the US. I think it was mostly the diversity and discovering new cultures. Before that, I was only in Western Europe and it was the first opportunity to go first in Eastern Europe and outside of Europe. I went to the lab and uh, met Professor Cozonde, who was training the Swiss team. And he proposed me to join in the Swiss team. And then the rest of history, basically, I made the Olympiads, then I studied chemistry, and now I'm here. So basically, any problem that has to do with material is something where chemistry will be the solution. If you speak global warming, it's CO2, it's a material gas, you need chemistry to solve it. Pollution, it's also chemistry that will solve it. So yes, of course, because nobody can ever have the whole solution. You always need a team, you need a high diversity of inputs, of viewpoints, and then you can find the optimal solution. Even defining optimality is something where you need many opinions. So I'm basically interested in processes, in manufacturing processes. And the chemical industry like BASF is still an industry where you can impact positively the processes, both economically and ecologically. And it's much more open than in industries where the processes themselves are regulated, like in agricultural or in pharmaceuticals. The best thing in BASF is really the global network of factories, people, competencies, that all work together to create chemistry for a sustainable future. The plastic industry has a strong mandate to improve the environmental impact of plastics. And we, as a leading supplier of plastic and plastic additives, take this really seriously. And we are working on also in my team to find a way to improve recyclability and to close the loop economy. I hope the students will have a lot of opportunities to enjoy the diversity of discussions and contacts and in our beautiful landscape and that they will be able to reach new summits. <laughs>